actually start it now. See how we do. Alright, so that, that mic is live, right? You want me to mute it?
got the one angle today. I figured out what to after I did.
please remain standing for the national anthem of Puerto Rico. All right, good evening everyone. Buenos tardes and welcome to day two of the 2021 NHCHC NORCA Women's Handball Championship. I know that was a lot of acronyms. The NHCHC is the North American and Caribbean Handball Confederation and the NORCA, well, that just happens to be a tournament that holds a ticket to the World Championships this December in Spain. And right now we've got uh, Puerto Rico uh, fresh off their 28 to 20 victory over the United States yesterday going up against Mexico who uh, played very well in a tough 33-27 defeat to Greenland. This should be a good one. And we're going to get started with this game in about 90 seconds or so. Uh, personally, I would think that Puerto Rico would be the favorite for this matchup. But after what I saw from this Mexico team uh, yesterday, they could pull this off. Very fun to watch. Very exciting to watch. And if their goalkeeper, Adela Venezuela, gets hot, then the line, if there was one, can go anywhere. Our refs today are from Karlitz, New Notch, Greenland, Amy Johansson, and Enoch Peterson. It's going to be their first match of the tournament. They're excited to get going. We're excited to get going. Mexico's excited to get going. Puerto Rico's excited to get going. And I hope you out there are also excited to get this one going. Mexico will be in the uh, black with red and green trim. Puerto Rico will be in red. And it looks like Mexico will start with the ball as we get this one going.
And that's it. We are underway. Mexico with the ball. Black, uh, red, and green trim. That is at number five. Anna Hernandez playing center back right now. Jimmy Leal, number two with the ball. Over at left wing, we've got number 17, Tamara Robles. At right back, we've got Fernando Rivera. And at right wing, we've got Dabani Ariaga, number 55. So we got to pivot out, pivot cross here to number 13. Uh, Lopez over to Jimmy Leal. Back in the middle. Rivera trying to go through. Can't break through. Jimmy Leal tries to set shot. Fakes it. No. Tries to pass the pivot. Nothing there. But there's a foul. They're going to bring this back. And they're going to try again for a free throw. All right, and here we go. Jimmy Leal, left to right, shot, blocked. As Sidis Garcia in Puerto Rico's fast breaking. It's Natalie Ceballos. And I'm beginning to think she does not miss this tournament. And just like that, it's 1-0 Puerto Rico. One thing this Puerto Rico team should have realized from yesterday's game is not to turn the ball over because Mexico because uh, Mexico cannot afford that against this Puerto Rican team. Puerto Rico will make you pay. They had 20 counterattacking chances against the United States last game. Stimuliao comes in. Foul on the play. Free throw only. May have been a bit of a slip there. We're going to keep this going. Hernandez over Rivera over the corner. Ariaga tries going for herself. Sneaks it in from a very oh, near angle. Number 55, Puerto Rico breaking quickly. Shot by Zilico Fuentes off the post. Mexico's coming back the other way. Zilico, Sheila Gerardo will break up the play there. Stop the break. Stop the momentum. And Mexico's going to have to gain that momentum in the half-court offense. Ediaga. Hernandez now through the middle off the cross. That's never we are going to get a quick two minute penalty on City Garcia. Two minute suspension for number 18, City Garcia. Not exactly sure what that was for. But the ref saw something. And as my old coach Andrew Wynn used to say, the ref has better eyes than you. Skip pass to the wing. Ariaga. Can't get it on target. Mex uh, Puerto Rico, excuse me, Puerto Rico has pulled their goalkeeper. They're going to play this offense 6v6. Dangerous if you turn the ball over. But it makes a huge difference in the offense otherwise. Natalie Ceballos with her second. Then Leo's on the left side. Leo will try and go to swing it across. Rivera now tries to go in for herself. Saved! Looks now to cut his skill. And now Looks now to cut his will take the bench allowing. I'm sorry, Elizabeth Rodriguez to check in as a pivot. We've got Zilico Fuentes and Sheila Rod on the left side there. Skip pass over to Eka Graziani. Pivot out play now. Good move there, but uh, Eka Graziani could not get that one on target. And Mexico's having a hard time uh, taking advantage. They try to take advantage here. That's a foot fault. And that's a technical foul. We're going the other way here. Puerto Rico's ball. And Puerto Rico's going to take their time. Chitarado's now going to check in as the sixth player. And they're going to uh, try and route out the rest of this two-minute penalty. Corrado. Zilica Fuentes. There you go, pivot out. A little broken there by number 55, cheating on the play. Corrado over the left side to Natalise. Natalise sneaks it to the wing. Fuentes off the top bar and out. Rebound. 
to this with Rodriguez. She can't convert. And Puerto Rico is now even quick pass into the wing. Oh. I believe Roxana Kerskill did get a hand to that shot from Jacqueline Lopez. But the ball hit the top post and out. It's on that end as well. Mexico's playing a 5-1. Slightly asymmetrical to the left here. Movement's going to start here from... I thought the move was going to start there. It is not. Maldonado. Ceballos from the empty cross right side. Tries to find Sheila Rado. Sheila Rado was fouled on the play. It's going to be a free throw to Puerto Rico. But that was a set play. Maybe for a Campo. Maybe. Rado loses the ball there. Saves it. Keeps it in play. Broken play. Now Fuentes finds Ceballos in the middle. Ceballos. Goes in for herself. Saved. But out for sides for Save for Adela Venezuela. But it remains Puerto Rico's ball. Ceballos in the middle. Swing it to the corner. Maldonado. Could not get that one on target. Okay, Jim and uh, Hernandez are calling something. It looks like gonna, this movement's going to start on the right side. It's going to be into cross right side. Fernandez, Terriaga, back to Rivera. Rivera tries to break it. Oh, that's violent. Gets pass over to Liao. It's wide. We got a two minute penalty there. On oh, number 15. Foul on Mexico in a free throw, says the referee. Yeah. All right. Puerto Rico's pulling their goalkeeper this time. Elizabeth Rodriguez checking in. Gerardo finds Sirius Garcia to space, but the ref's going to say she's on the line. Quick restart there, but Natalie Ceballos is wise. No goal. Yeah. Natalie Ceballos is there for the interception. And Puerto Rico's going to milk some more time off this clock. Two pivot offense here against this 5-1 defense. Okay, looks like Puerto Rico is now even. Ceballos from the right side into Series Garcia. Can't get it there. Back to Gerardo in the middle. Gerardo set shot! Buries it! Now we can restart play in case this is your first time wondering. All players on one team have to be behind the midfield uh, and the restart. And the ball's got to be there too. Anyway. Aaron Az is calling the play. I believe it will start from the left side this time. We got an empty cross here. Hernandez here now at left back. And a second empty cross to Liao. Liao tries to go in for herself. Might have some space. Foul. No continuation. There's the restart. Yeah, cross court pass to Rivera. Rivera coming back to the middle. Finds nothing there but a wall of red. Passive play is up. See if you can figure out the rules if you don't know what it is. Hernandez over the Rivera. Rivera right to left. Shot fouled on the play. Free throw. Yeah. Even I could see that was a foul. Passive play remains. Rivera, quick restart. Saved Roxanne Carasquillo, her third. So if this is your first handball game and you don't know what passive play is, once the hand goes up, you've got up to six passes. Some limited exceptions to get a shot off or you lose possession of the ball. No shot clock. This isn't the NBA. 
Just if you're not making a concerted attempt to attack, ref is going to say enough of that. Natalie Sabayos, though, this is a concerted attempt to attack there, but Janine Maldonado pushes it wide for Puerto Rico. Coming back to the other Hernandez trying to start this with pace immediately. Ariaga to Rivera. Rivera to Hernandez. Hernandez slips a little, tries to find Slace. Ref is calling. Ref is calling seven meters, saying it. She was impeded. And taking the seven meters for Mexico is the Bani Ariaga. I'm sorry, no, it's Jimmy Liao. Quick shots. And save. Roxanali Carasquillo. Leal. Hernandez is calling the play here. Second pivot in for Mexico. Going to work from the right side here. Ariaga can't find anything. Rivera looking. Finds Hernandez. Wing is open. Pass is not the best. Saved. Carasquillo. They're breaking. Cities Garcia off the post. And now it's Mexico's ball. Quick pass over the wing to Bani Ariaga. Carasquillo is up to it. And Maldonado here off the break. Sneaks it in near side. Does Janine Maldonado. And it hasn't been textbook, but it has been effective by Puerto Rico so far. And honestly, I'll take effective over... Uh, textbook every day instant passive play here from Mexico all right John Vergara has been held off the court and taking this seven meter throw is Natalie Ceballos and she buries it Puerto Rico with a 6-2 lead right now. Mexico's going to pull their goalkeeper to get a six player on offense. Jim Lee out with the Nothing there. Robles to Hernandez. Hernandez in the middle. Hernandez trying to break through. Can't get anything. Vargas tries to shoot over the defense. Can't find the target. Puerto Rico on the break here. Goal scored there from Lisbeth Gar uh, excuse me, Lisbeth Rodriguez. And Mexico is going to take a timeout and think about this for a little bit. And with this timeout with 15:49 left to go in this first half, the score is seven to two in favor of Puerto Rico. And we'll be back with you in a few short seconds. We got Ceballos here calling the play. Number two, Adriana Cabrera is checked in. Empty pivot around, not taken. Lisbeth Rodriguez met. And fouled by Jacqueline Lopez. Good D there. Cabrera goes in for herself. They're going to call steps. It's going to be Mexico's ball. All right. Mexico going to try to bring pace here. Lopez tries to get it to the wing. No barging call. That's going to be a goal scored by number 55, Debiani. Ariaga. And Mexico must have had one heck of a 
timeout talk because they've been able to find some movement that works against this Puerto Rico defense. All right, Cabrera right side. Met immediately pa pass to Ceballos. Passes to Maldonado who puts it wide. Hernandez, left back. Over to Rivera. Back, back to Rivera. Hernandez in the middle. Looks for the left wing. Robles can't do anything with it. Hernandez down the middle. Gets past one. Meets another. No foul given. Save Carrasquillo. Second chance here. Tries to get to a wing. No barge call. They're going to say nothing was there but a technical fault. Turnover. There on Mexico. Puerto Rico's not going to break. They're just going to call a play here right now. All right. Pivot out there. It's Matt. It's over to Ceballos. Ceballos all cross court to Cabrera. Right side with the pivot help. Cabrera can't find anything. Ceballos sneaks it to the wing. Wing, low angle. Adela Valenzuela is wise to it, and they are breaking, but Ceballos is there. Quick movement there, coming the other way, and that's a goal score by number 24, Robles Ortiz. Best way to make up for a missed shot is to make the next one. Robles Ortiz just did that. Rivera, Hernandez, Robles now on the right side, cheating up because you have two pivots in now for Mexico. We're going to have a pivot cross on the line. Rivera sneaks it to the wing. Ariaga has no space. Rivera in the middle, looking, tries to pass this to the pivot. Gets tipped. Not a turnover. Ariaga with space on the broken play. She puts it home. And after a slow start, this Mexican team is finding a lot of movement. And Puerto Rico is going to think about that for a little bit. 8-5 to five is our score. 11-37 left to go in the first half. And we're back on the way here. Puerto Rico with possession of the ball. Ortiz, Arado, Lisbeth Rodriguez now in at center back. Cedis Garcia now looking right. Another cross there. Sheila Arado in the middle. Tries to break in. Finds Graciani. Graciani finds the space. And that's her second. Mexico breaking here quickly. And then it's looking for a pass, finds Robles on the left. Gets it across, cross court to Ariaga. Save! Yes! Save made there by Kitsi Escobar. Free throw away there, fouled by Deban Ariaga. Restart the play here. Sheila Harado is going to call the play. Moving the center back now. Lisbeth. Graziani. 
Cedis Garcia in the pivotal round. To the middle. With pace does Elizabeth. Double shot there. Second shot is wide. Mexico coming back the other way here. Anna. There is a lot of space there for Robles, but she can't get the ball with momentum. Allowing Puerto Rico to make a quick and easy stop there. Free throw to Puerto Rico. I'm sorry, free throw for Mexico. Foul by Puerto Rico. Hernandez thought she had space in the middle. Quick pass over to the wing. And it's a four goal lead for Puerto Rico here. As we hit un the nine minute mark left in this first half. And it is over to Leal, right back. Met by Gerardo, Van is given. 14, sneaks in, can't get anything going. Second shot is put in. By number 25, Lucero Quezada. And Mexico is starting to find some offensive fluency. Gerardo, Ortiz, Gerardo in the middle now, gets it right to Graziani, Graziani, shot is off the post and out, and Mexico's got a chance to make this a two goal game, checking in now at center back is uh, Tamar Robles, Jimmy Leal joining it right back, Rivera is going to shift down the right wing, Two pivot offense, I should say. So not really center back. There's Robles, but Liao into the pivot. Great pass! Goal scored there by Jacqueline Lopez. And Mexico is slowly but surely gaining momentum here. Puerto Rico's got to keep the composure offensively. Fuentes. Gerardo now in the middle. To Natalie Ceballos. Finds Salika Fuentes behind the back. And that's, that's the answer from Puerto Rico. Robles Leal. Leal through. Save. Kitsa. Escobar. Puerto Rico breaking quick the other way. Sheila Arado. Only a free throw. Only a free throw. Graziani, Ceballos, Gerardo. Gerardo finds the pivot, pivots held up, no foul, no foul. Mexico's breaking the other way. Can't get a full break, they give it up. Escobar's got Zalika Fuentes. And Zalika Fuentes. The size she felt like scoring. Puerto Rico up four. Oh. Robles Liao over to Rivera in the wing. Nothing there. Liao in the middle. Robles trying to find the pivot. Gives it up. Unlucky. Looks like she may have slipped. Fuentes is breaking. Fuentes. And Zalika Fuentes felt like scoring again. That's her third. And you can't give this Puerto Rican team counterattacking goals because they will take advantage. And they are taking advantage. Yeah. 
Leal Hernandez over the wing. Nothing in the wing. They're going to bring it back around. Leal in the middle over to number 25, Quezada. Quezada finds nothing. Wing around. Back to Leal in the middle. Leal goes in for herself. Gets met. Hard. Quick restart. No foul given. Second chance here. And that's going to be barging. That's going to be a turnover. And that's going to be Puerto Rico's ball. Three unanswered here for Puerto Rico. And with four minutes left in this half, they're going to do their utmost to go into this second half with all the momentum they can get. Gerardo, Garcia, Graziani in the middle now. Not much doing, just a free throw there, no continuation given. We're going to restart this for Sabayo on the right side, Graziani in the middle, and Geraldo on the left side for Puerto Rico. Sirius Garcia, pivot out. Swings left to Gerardo. Gerardo to Ceballos in the middle with pace, with space. And that is not only Ceballos' fourth goal in five shots this half. And that's forward answer for Puerto Rico. And Mexico really really wants to get something right here and now. Liao goes in for herself. Well done. Quick restart here from Puerto Rico. Finds, tries to find a pivot. Can't find the pivot. Puerto Rico will slow this down a little bit. Try and get something quality going here. Gerardo fakes to Garcia. Ceballos over to Graziani. Graziani back to Ceballos. Back to Gerardo. Quick pass to the wing. Wing gets it. Save. Made there by number 16, Natalie Gonzalez. And here comes Mexico the other way. Quezada to Hernandez. Hernandez tries to go in. There is nothing there. No one is there to help her. She wants the help. She wants the life on. She wants to keep the ball moving. Going to see the movie start here from Rivera. Empty cross. Then it's in the middle. Goes in herself. They're going to call us. Seven meter. And a two minute penalty on... Eka Graziani with the two minute suspension. And Debani Eriaga gets her fourth goal of the half. And Mexico's doing their utmost to mitigate that momentum this Puerto Rican team has created. Pool keeper has been pulled from Puerto Rico. They're going to go for two pivot offense here. Gerardo and Ceballos in the backcourt. Sirius Garcia and Lisbeth Rodriguez on pivot. Gerardo comes left to right at the cross. Goes in for herself. A lot of contact there, but the refs say free throw only. <laughs> Some of the fans here are saying that was nothing. Anyway, back to the actions. Lika Fuentes can't get that on target. Mexico trying to break. Long, another long pass. And that's going to end up Mexico's ball. Eh. Unfortunately, uh, and then unfortunately after that, another turnover from Mexico. That's their 10th of the half. That if, you remember, if you were with us at the beginning, I mentioned earlier in the half that Mexico have a chance because this Puerto Rican team cannot turn the ball over. Lopez Rodriguez in the series. Garcia in the pivot. Tries to get it up, but a free throw is given. We're down under 10 seconds for this half. Puerto Rico's going to do something happy. 
And now Ace Sabaros just wants to shut me up. Five goals on six shots. This half for Natalie Ceballos and Puerto Rico is up 15 to 10 at halftime. We'll be back with the second half of this contest in about 14 minutes and 54 seconds. Stick around. Just 
I was going to say. Hey, any kind of feedback would be good. No, I got feedback. Make sure I pronounce Emma's last name correctly, otherwise, someone in that family is going to come and get me. What are you saying? Ready. How am I supposed to know? Dude, I thought it was ready too. All right, halftime talks are over and done with. We're back now for the second half of Puerto Rico versus Mexico. Mexico is 0-1, Puerto Rico is 1-0. Puerto Rico in the red, Mexico in the black with the green and red trim. Ceballos on the right side, over to Maldonado. Cabrera back to Ceballos, Chilorado across the middle, lots of space, but she takes too many steps. Otherwise, that was a very good play. Yet here it is, Mexico on the other way. Get Robles. Leal. Robles almost causes the football there. Not so much, says the referee. Zimmer Leal over Hernandez in the middle, swinging it wide. Ariaga can't get anything. Back to Rivera, back to Hernandez, back to Leal. Leal trying to break in. Earns a free throw for the foul. And nothing more. Quick pass into the pivot. Save Zugeli Soto. From the shot there from Jacqueline Lopez. Zugeli Soto just checking in for the first time this match. Rivera to Hernandez. Hernandez tries to go through the middle. Can't do it. Over to the wing. Ariaga with space. Save. Zugeli Soto. Puerto Rico tries to break that, but they turn it over, unfortunately. Foul there. Uh, some words exchanged. I'm not going to repeat them. Mostly because I didn't hear them. But I'm not going to repeat them. But it's Mexico's ball, nevertheless. Nandez is calling the play. I believe we're going to see movement starting from the right here. Quick ring cross to Ariaga. Back to Hernandez in the middle. Tries to go 1 1. Garcia. Garcia tries to take an offensive foul. Ref is not having any of it. Mexico at the start again. Leal. Sweet. Swing pass to the wing. Ariaga can't take advantage. Rivera over to Leal on the left. Tries to feed the pivot. The pivot makes the turn. The pivot earns the seven. Great job, Jacqueline Lopez. Great job, Jacqueline Lopez. Ariaga sends the goalkeeper the wrong way. And Ariaga has her fifth goal of the game. As she and this Mexican team try to reduce this Puerto Rican lead. Fuentes Ceballos, the cross, Gerardo in the middle. Cabrera finds the pivot, Sears Garcia. Big save there, Adela Valenzuela.
Cabrera doesn't go for the wing, goes in for herself. Steps is the call. I thought they had to pass the wing. Not so much, it seems. Mexico going the other way here quickly. Second order break. Nope. It's Nico Fuentes. And I believe that is Nico Fuentes' third goal off a fast break. The counter-attacking play of Puerto Rico is what got them over the United States in the first game of this tournament. And it's been a major difference in this one so far. P pivot out. Rivera to Leal. Leal in the middle. Tries to find the pivot. Does find the pivot. Great play there by Jacqueline Lopez. She gets her second. Gerardo left to right, swings it to Cabrera. Cabrera back to Gerardo with space, tries to find Sirius Garcia. Can't do it. And another long pass by Mexico. This time it connects. This time it's a break. And Hannah Hernandez finishes this off. Puerto Rico has been wise to the long pass all game, but Mexico finally converts. And this leads down to three. Garcia. Fuentes on left side. Gerardo. This is an asymmetrical 5-1 right now. We're going to get a pivot out. Sirius Garcia is going to swing it over to the right side to Graziani. Pass is broken up by Raga. Almost with the turnover. Couldn't do it. Ceballos finds Gerardo. Gerardo goes in. Finds a foul and nothing more. Quick restart there. Graziani can't find any space. Mexico's asking for pass the play. The hand is up. Garcia back to Gerardo. Gerardo sets shot low. Shio Gerardo scores her third. Puerto Rico sends the lead back to four. Is that going to be barging? They're going to call barging. I don't think... The defender was there, but the refs say she was. Puerto Rico's ball. Goal scored there by Erica Graziani. And just like that, that three-goal lead is now five. The reason I said I don't think the uh, that was certain offensive fouls that the defender didn't really give the offender a chance to... Uh, do anything, but the rest start uh, different, and the rest are a lot closer to the action than I am. I'll tell you that we've got action on the line there. We're going to say uh, another turnover here from Mexico. One of the offensive players crossed through the six illegally, And it's going to be Puerto Rico's ball. And another turnover to this Mexican team. Their 13th of the match. Third of this half. And this, math, this half is only eight minutes old. And like I said at the beginning, and I'll say it again. You cannot turn the ball over against this Puerto Rican team. Now at least Ceballos with a bad pass. Mexico's asking for passive play. Refs aren't having it yet. Gerardo left side. Set shot. Bang. Sheila Gerardo with her fourth goal now. But it's the score for the team that matters more. And right now, Puerto Rico is up 19-13. All right, lots of crossing here. Rivera on the right side of Leal. We've got players popping in and to the pivot position. With nothing to show for it but a free throw. Then Mexico will have to try again. Mexico's... Puerto Rico is extending their defense ever so much. And Aaron Hernandez passes it. Not to her teammate. And it's Puerto Rico's ball. Yeah. 
Substitutions now in for Puerto Rico. We've got Lisbeth Rodriguez in at left back. Janine Maldonado in at pivot. And Alonso Benitez in at right wing. We've got Maldonado off the pivot cross over to Graziani. Ceballos with pace down the middle. And Natalie Ceballos, Natalie Ceballos, cannot miss. Mexico's going to think about it. Mexico uses their second timeout of three if they use them in time. I'll get to that after the break. 20 to 13 is our score. Puerto Rico in control. All right, timeout is timeout is over. We're back here, 20 to 13, Puerto Rico over Mexico. As I was saying before, well, as we are going into the break, teams have three timeouts per game, but they must use their third timeout with a certain amount of time left in the game. So if it's outside the last five minutes, Mexico still has one timeout left, but not after that. Anyway, Mexico right now is calling the action. Now Lisa Bios is cheating up in an asymmetric 5-1. It's more of an asymmetric 4-2 here. Rivera, Leal on the wing. Save. Sugeli Soto. One two play. Bro uh Cinco Fuentes can't handle the two on the one two pass. Puerto Rico will set up again on the right side. Graziane, space on the wing. Save made and controlled by Mexico. Save made there by Natalie Gonzalez. Off the shot from Alanis Benitez. Alright, empty cross the backs there. Robles to Rivera. Arriaga back to Robles. Robles, one two play. Not getting anything going there. Back in the middle to Rivera. Rivera Leal crossing. Dribbles come over. Comes through. Met by Fuentes. And I was going to say the contact was outside of the six, and that's going to be a free throw. Robles tries to find the pivot. Doesn't see an option. Rivera going across court, finds space for herself and scores. What? Goal scored there by Fernanda Rivera. All right, Mexico's really extending their defense here. It's a very high 4-2. Sirius Garcia will try and create for herself. Gets over the wings. Zico Fuentes can't hold it. That's going to be a turnover. We are going the other way. Fuentes stepped inside the six there. That's the eighth turnover here for Puerto Rico. Compared to 14 for Mexico.
Vargas over to Liao. Rivera down the middle with pace. Tries to find the pivot. Can't find anything. We're going to see a yellow card here. Actually. Yeah. Now it's going to be a two minutes here to Erika Graziani. Do I want to explain why I thought that was a two minutes? Sure. Let me explain why I thought that was a why they gave two minutes there. One, we're in the second half. Yes, there haven't been that many yellow cards in this game as Mexico scores there. Cynthia Gallegos takes advantage of the player advantage. But this is also, not only is this just the second half and there were not many yellow cards in the even though there are not many yellow cards in the first half, yellow cards are not a second half thing. Zico, um, Natalie Ceballos coming in, finds Zico Fuentes on the wing. Zico Fuentes scores her fifth. Ooh, Ariaga hit hard, but finds. It's a Vargas who scores, but we also have a two-minute penalty here. And right now, Puerto Rico have to play 6v4. Anyway, the point I'm trying to say here is that Erica Graziani already had two-minute suspension. You can't really give a yellow card after a two-minute suspension. And now she has two. And if she gets three, that's the end of her night. But first, Mex uh, Puerto Rico is going to use their second timeout and think about how they want to play these next few seconds down two players. Stick with us. This could get good. All right, back to the action here. Maldonado finds Lika Fuentes. I'm sorry, Sheila Horado. Lots of space in the rim. Hits the post. Now it's Lika Fuentes. Sorry about that. A few seconds into the future there. Itzel Vargas. Fouled by uh, Sheila Horado. Free throw only. And Mexico still has a two-player advantage here. They should get a quality shot on goal. That's unfortunate. Itzel Vargas was deemed to be inside the six on the turn. And that's going to be Puerto Rico's ball. No goal. Right now, Puerto Rico is going to take their time on this offensive series because they should have one player check back in any moment now. Mexico is going to try and man mark three of the players. Player mark three of the players. Well, now they're right to left. And we got a two-minute suspension here on Itzel Vargas for Mexico. Cidis Garcia held up there. Right now, both teams are playing 5v5. Maldonado can't find the goal. Unfortunately, she is getting the opportunities, but she is one for five today. 
Not the performance she was hoping for so far. Mexico swings it quickly there to Yaga. We should have a few more seconds at least of this 5v5 action. Puerto Rico will be full first. Sheila Gerardo. Ref saying it's in. Ref is saying it's in. You know what? We're just going to go with it. He's right there. He can see it, Ref. It's a goal for Sheila Gerardo, her fifth. Rivera trying to create her own. Get space for Leal on the cross. Stolen by Gerardo. Ceballos gets it to the right side. Too many steps there from Joanne Vergara. Cannot convert. And that's the rare fast break opportunity wasted by this Puerto Rican team. At least Robles calling the play here. I believe this is going to start from the right. There's the cross right. We got a wing end, sit and pivot. Rivera down the middle. Met by Graziani. And Graziani's complaining that she's coming in with her head, but uh, ref's not having any of it. Starting to play back again. Robles met by Geraldo. Over to Quezada. Quezada. Finds the pivot. Pivot is met immediately. Is Jacqueline Lopez met by uh, multiple Puerto Rican players. Hand is up for passive play. Rivera shoots, gets it, puts it wide. Ceballos quickly in the series. Garcia, she tries to turn. She does turn. She lobs it over the keeper. See this Garcia. Extends this lead to 7. 12, 18 left to go on this one. And Puerto Rico is up 24, 17. It's not panic time yet for Mexico, but they will need to put another dent in this league. Rivera tries to get in the pivot, takes steps and set. Unfortunate. Here's Luca Fuentes. That's a goal for Zico Fuentes. And that is her seventh. And that is another counter-attacking goal by this Puerto Rican team. Vargas back in. Quezada. Robles now trying to start the action. Tries to find Jacqueline Lopez but off of her hands and out of play Puerto Rico making some substitutions here Ruben Ortiz coming in at left wing Elizabeth Rodriguez at left back. Ceballos is still in. Empty cross. Uh, pivot cross to Sirius Garcia. Empty cross. Here comes Graziani. They're calling steps on Graziani. And that's Puerto Rico's 10th turnover of this match. And now we've got a technical stoppage here. Our uh, NHCAC official. Uh, Alejandro Martinez has said that uh, the Puerto Rico Puerto Rican bench uh, crossed the line a little bit with the words. Maybe said something that was not kosher, and that's an administrative yellow card. To Camille Estevez. 
Back to the action here. We're going to call steps here on Lucero Quisada. Another turnover for this Mexican team. And with 10 minutes and 5 seconds left to go in this one, you cannot afford any more turnovers if you're Mexico. All you need now are goals and stops. No turnovers, no two-minute penalties. You basically have to be per play perfect handball. Ceballos now here on the left side after the movement. Pito Diaga saved. Natalie Gonzalez, exactly what you need. Mexico's going to try and move the ball quickly. Arriaga going the other way. Fouled. Free throw from Mexico. Uh, Rivera. Quezada to her left. Rivera almost takes too many steps there. Quezada finds Galay. Goes in the left corner. Back over Rivera. There. This Mexican team is not getting much done. Never mind, shut me up. Lucero Quezada with her second. Number 25, Lucero Quezada. <laughs> and right now, well, Puerto Rico switches goalkeepers. Uh, Roxanati Carrasquillo comes back in. Well, on the offensive side, Elizabeth Rodriguez with the space to go 1v1 and does the job. And Puerto Rico is plus eight with eight minutes and 23 seconds to go. Ooh, Rivera could not get it. She is down right now. Oh, I believe Ortiz took too many steps there, but uh, Fernanda Rivera is going to go to the bench there. She's limping right now. The Mexican staff is going to take a look at her. Gallegos, Leal, Quizada, Vargas, Ariaga, Vargas, Quizada, Leal, left side with space, can't get anything going back to the right. Switch. Pass to Ariaga, can't get space. Vargas from right back gets it into the pivot. Pivot is inside the six. And that is definitely not what you needed if you were Mexico. Puerto Rico now pulling their goalkeeper. Playing 7v6 here. Maybe they're practicing something uh, for the third game. Maybe they just want to score a goal. Elizabeth Rodriguez wanted to score a goal. Sweet. Lazy pass to the pivot. Easily defended by Puerto Rico. Lazy pass from Puerto Rico. Easily taken by Erdiaga. And Ariaga's shot is wide. Nelly Sabalos was there in the fence. Forced that shot. Or provided enough to uh, make that shot miss. Balos, Elizabeth Rodriguez gets her fourth. And we're under six minutes now. I believe that may have been the dagger. Anya Vargas. Itzel Vargas, excuse me. Shoots it just high. And I think Puerto Rico may have this in the bag. And if they do have this in the bag, that's their second win of this tournament. And they are guaranteed to play in the championship game two days from now but who will they play that's the real question Cabrera Ceballos 
Second pivot out, second pivot back in. Skip past to Natalie Ceballos, over to uh, yeah. number 24, Robles Ortiz. Robles Ortiz. It's inside, Mexico's ball the other way, Itza Vargas. Can't get much done, Mexico's gonna take their time and get a quality shot here. Under five minutes now. Arriaga jump shot saved. Roxanati Carasquillo, her knife saved this afternoon. Ooh, offensive foul for Puerto Rico. Now we're going the other way. Arriaga's being held up. Mexico can't break here. Arriaga doesn't care about what I'm saying. Forces the action. Gets a free throw for, the, for all of her work. Franklin <laughs> Lopez teases the uh, immediate shot. Vargas from the pass from Leal and Itzel Vargas scores. Under four minutes now. Puerto Rico is up nine. Angeline Maldonado makes it 10. Three and a half minutes left to go on this one. Mexico wants to end on a high note and with momentum for their third game versus the United States of America. Speaking of the United States of America, Jim Leo shoots, sends the keeper the other way, scores her third. Coming up next at, no foul here, no foul here, turnover going the other way. <laughs> Jimmy Leal picks up another one for Troubles. It's now an eight goal game as we fall under three minutes. But coming up next at uh, 7 p.m. Central Time, Central Daylight Time, 8 p.m. Eastern Daylight Time, 5 p.m. Pacific Daylight Time. It's going to be Greenland, Carlos Nunat, versus the United States of America. United States of America had an unfortunate performance there. Anna Hernandez not giving up on this. Thought she created a turnover. Ref saying no. But the United States, as I was saying, they had an unfortunate start to this tournament, losing by eight to this Puerto Rican team off the back of 23 turnovers. And they're going to face what I thought were the tournament favorites here, Greenland. Who look very fluid offensively. Very fundamentally sound defensively. It's going to be a huge test for this women's national team of the United States. We'll see what they can do. Pass is broken up and lost there by Natalie Ceballos. Mexico breaking the other way. They've got a 3v3. Tamara Robles takes it for herself. And this leads down to seven. Sabados tries to pass into the pivot. They're going to stay off the pivot's foot. Going the other way. Eats a Vargas. With a fast break goal. And with one minute left to go, this is a six goal game. This result is not in doubt, but this is a great way for Mexico to end this competition with momentum for tomorrow. Now in it, left back is Silomar Ortiz. Um, and she unfortunately puts it wide. Mexico's gonna try and finish this at a minus five or better. Oh, Robles loses the ball. Silva Ortiz, I think she got shot in the save. And a two minutes of Jim Leal for simulation.
And that's going to be the end of Jim Leal's night. 15 seconds to go. And Mexico's trying to get one last goal in. Goal difference could matter for them. But Tamara Robles puts in one more and they will finish this one. With Puerto Rico winning 29 to 24. My name is Brian Cothorn. Please stick around for the United States versus Greenland. Congratulations to Puerto Rico and great effort, Mexico. Stick around. <laughs>